When you, in the beginning, were first being criticized by people who were more fundamentalists, who were more orthodox, more strict in their beliefs, that there's not enough doctrine, yeah. there's not enough um, Christ yeah. in the message. Sure. Well, you know, again, Oprah, I try to get up every morning and just search my own heart and say, God, am I doing what you want me to do? And I feel like if I can be pure and feel good before God that I, I don't have to, you know, I always want to listen to people and receive good criticism, but I just feel like I don't have to answer them. I have to answer to God. And so I just try to stay focused on what God's called me to do. You, you walk the walk. You just don't talk it. Well... You know, he does pro seem to proclaim the true gospel of Christ. And if you say he doesn't show me specifically where he says how you get saved is X, Y, Z, and it's not the actual biblical gospel. Like, I haven't seen that, so I can't say that. Of course, Osteen teaches some version of the prosperity gospel. Why would, you, why would anybody criticize you for preaching prosperity? Because what kind of God wants you to be poor and miserable? That's the way I feel as well.